Hello everybody, Cosmos here, and welcome back to Would You Rather? So, um, yeah, here we go, we're gonna carry on. You guys really enjoyed the last episode, and I enjoyed playing it, so... Would you rather dive a moped on type... Wait, what? Oh, drive, not dive. Drive a moped on a tightrope, or go over Niagara Falls in a barrel. Okay, well, I, I, know, I know stories about guys going over Niagara Falls in a barrel, and there was like, they only found his arm? So, driving a moped across a tightrope, a, a centimetre off the ground, right? Yeah, yeah, tightrope. More people would rather go over Niagara Falls in a barrel. Is it not a centimetre off the ground like I'm saying it is? <laughs> oh, okay, alright, fine, whatever. Next question. Would you rather be a cyborg or be an, be an animal-human fusion thing? An animal human fusion thing. Wow, okay. So, uh, obviously, I'd be me and mixed with an animal. Which animal would it be? Um, do extinct animals count? Because if so, Velociraptor. How awesome would that be? That would be amazing. Hmm. But then, if you're a cyborg, you could live forever. Kind of, right? That is what a cyborg is, right? It's like human robot. Yeah? Am I right about that? I think I'm right about that. So I I'd rather be cyborg. Definitely. Yeah, more people would. Only just though. It's fairly evenly split. I nearly paused the recording then. That was weird. Would you rather own a pet snake, own a pet turtle, own a pet turtle? I don't like snakes. They're horrible. They don't need to exist. Go away, snakes. Next question. <laughs> okay. Would you rather have hair covering your entire body or be completely bald? Um, okay, well, oh, that's tough. I don't think I look very good bold. I, I just, I can't see it, you know? I think I'd look very weird, and I don't want to look weird. So, hair covering your entire body would be weird as well, though. You'd look like a monkey. I don't want to look like a monkey. Where's the, th can I have a third option? Or just not change anything? Or just be me. I want to be me. Ah. Oh. Oh, completely bold. That means no eyebrows either or anything. Oh, crap. Um, completely covered in hair, like your face and everything. I think I'd rather, honestly, I'd rather be bold than covered in hair. Yeah, most people would. A lot more people would rather be bold. Okay, would you rather live an average life and be forgotten in time or go down in history for something terrible? So, would you rather be me? Would I rather be me, or, I don't know, Hitler? Rather be me, thank you very much. I don't want to be remembered for, for bad things. No. Nobody wants to be remembered for that. Well, apart from Hitler, probably. I don't know. I'm going to stop talking about Hitler now. I'd rather be me. <laughs> Most people would. Would you rather be emo or be gothic, please? I'd rather be a big goth. Be big black goth. Covered in black nail varnish and stuff like that. Okay. <laughs> Can you imagine me being goth? That would be weird, wouldn't it? <laughs> okay. Would you rather be dangled over the edge of a cliff or be forced to public speak? Okay. Well, okay. I, I haven't really got a fear of heights or anything. So, but then being dangled over it probably would scare me a bit. Yeah, probably scare most people. But being forced to public speak, I can't do that. No, I, I'd rather, I honestly would rather be dangled off a cliff than speak in public. I can't do public speaking. It scares the crap out of me. I'd rather be dangled off a cliff. But most people would rather public speak, which makes sense, I guess. People are a lot more confident than me, I guess. <laughs> would you rather never be able to hear your favourite song again or never be able to watch your favourite movie again? Oh, oh. Okay, I don't, I don't think I have a favourite song ever. But, honestly, I would rather never be able to listen to my favourite song again. Because I don't have one. But even if I did, I, I'm a huge film buff. I, I love films. So I couldn't go without watching my favourite film. That being Avatar. Um, James Cameron's Avatar. Not, not the Airbender one. No. <laughs> but yeah, I, I don't think I could never watch that again. That No. I'd, I'd, I'd ditch the song. I want to watch Avatar. I might watch Avatar tonight. I'm probably going to watch Avatar now. 
Most people, oh, that is really evenly split. 51 to 49 percent. Okay. Would, oh, okay, not would you rather. If you had to eat bugs, would you rather eat 100 ants or 50 beetles? Uh, none. Okay, um, I don't like bugs at all. I am the biggest wimp you will ever meet in your life when it comes to bugs. Ants, butterflies, I know that sounds ridiculous. People are like, why are you scared of butterflies? They look awesome. Yeah, but people don't like moths and they're essentially the same thing. All they do is flap around and get in your face and... Ugh, no. Oh, can I be dangled off a cliff again? Is is that okay? Can I can I choose the the or in the middle or be? I just add another or here and it, be dangled off a cliff, please. Oh, beetles or ants? Are they dead or are they alive? Either way, that's disgusting, and I ah uh, I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know at all. Um, eh, I don't know. I'm just gonna go by if they're dead. So, eating 100 ants will probably... Right, it will take longer to eat 50 beetles because beetles are bigger than ants, right? So, ants. Yeah, most people would eat ants because... You think about it, right? If they're dead, you think how many ants you could fit on like a spoon compared to beetles? It would be far easier to eat the ants. You probably wouldn't need to chew that much either, so that's good. Okay, would you rather have a conversation with Yoda for 10 minutes or punch Jar Jar Binks for an hour? Oh, okay. They're both pretty cool. I want to do both of those. Can I do both? Can, can I just highlight and select all? Can I do that? I don't think I can do that. No, I can't do that. <laughs> oh, I can do that. There we go. Done. Question answered. <laughs> ah, okay. Conversation with Yoda for 10 minutes. There's so much stuff I could ask. But then I could punch Jar Jar. Which would be awesome. Hmm. Yoda. I pick Yoda. Most people would talk to Yoda. 35% would want to punch Jar Jar for an hour, though. That's understandable, but Yoda's cooler. Why waste your time on Jar Jar, right? Would you rather eat 50 celery sticks every day or eat Brussels sprouts every day? Does this game know what I don't like? Like, all the insects or all the vegetables? What? What? Does this game know me? This game knows me. This is weird. I don't eat fruit, veg, or salad -y stuff. I, I never have. I never will. I don't like none of it. Um, okay. So, this would be none. Like, none. I, none. I, I can't pick because I don't like either of them. I hate them both equally. Um, which would be easier to eat? Right, I, I, if I go with celery sticks... Then, potentially, I could blitz them up with, like, nice stuff. Like, I know, like, pizza? <laughs> I just put it in a blender with some Burger King burgers and pizza. I didn't, and I wouldn't be able to drink that. That would be disgusting. Why would I do that? I wouldn't do that. Yogurt. Oh, strawberry and yog ice cream. Oh, yeah, I could blend it with ice cream and, and uh, milk and, uh, um, I don't know, like a chocolate bar. Make myself a homemade milkshake. Wouldn't even be able to taste it. Celery. Yes. Most people will pick celery. Not a lot of people like Brussels sprouts, but the people that do like them are lethal. They are so lethal. It's bad. It's really bad. Okay, this is going to be the last question. Let's make it a good one. Would you rather prevent World War II or win a life-changing amount of money in a lottery? Okay. Now, I know what I'm going to pick here. And my reasons are, I don't know. Okay, I would rather win the money on the lottery because I could prevent World War Two. yeah. But right now, at this day and age, it would make more sense for me to win the lottery than to go back in time and help people then. Why not help people now? Like, it makes no difference. But if I do the helping people now, then with the amount of money that I have, I could, I could help a lot more people in the world and a lot more charities and I could I could properly kick my gaming setup out I could help my friends get gaming sets help my family there's a lot more that I could do nowadays than preventing World War 2 
if that makes any sense at all. I know what I'm thinking. I know. Don't worry. I know what I'm thinking. But yeah, there's there's a lot more I could do now with a huge amount of money, a life changing amount of money. It says so that could be anything, millions even, than going back and preventing World War Two. Although that would be awesome too. Like I said, there's more that I could do with the money at this day and age. So I'd go with that. Let's see what most people picked. <laughs> most people went with the money. Few people went with prevent World War Two. Pretty good question. I enjoyed that. Kind of tempted to do. We'll do one more. This is going to be the final question. Okay. Did that's a crap question? I don't want my question. Go away, question. Would you rather wear a ski suit all the time or go everywhere barefoot? What a random question to end on, but sure. Um, a ski suit. What's a ski suit like? It's like a onesie, but like really thick padded onesie, isn't it? Or go everywhere barefoot. No. Ski suit, please. Thank you. Everyone would rather be barefoot. But... Oh yeah, crap. What do you do when you go to the toilet and stuff like that? I think I picked wrong. But I don't care. Guys, we're going to end it here. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed watching. If you have, hit the like button, subscribe, leave a comment. And I will see you lovely, awesome, amazing people in the next video. Bye-bye.